Your filter pump manual has instructions for easy setup, but it is sometimes easy to miss something. Here are a few tips for the most important things to watch for. If you are adding accessories, you can check the total amperage by adding the amps per accessory. On the side of the filter tower, you will find the amperage on the silver label. If the pump is on, but there is no water flowing, air is trapped in the hose lines. For smaller pumps using the A cartridge, unplug the pump from the electrical outlet, remove any wall plugs which may have been overlooked, and open the air relief valve on the filter tower to let trapped air out. For larger pumps which use the B size cartridges, close the pool valves and open the air relief valve on the filter tower. For models 633 and 635, open the lower valve first and then the upper valve. You may have to shake the intake hose up and down to allow air to move out through the valve. Model 633 also has an air relief valve over the connection on the motor housing which can be opened to allow air out. Before opening the filter pump to check your filter cartridge, it is important to first turn off or unplug the filter pump and either close the valves at the connectors or if your pool does not have valves, plug the connector holes with wall plugs. If filter cartridges are not available locally, you can order them by contacting Intex Consumer Service directly. It is very important to have a GFCI outlet installed before hooking up your filter pump. The current interrupting circuit in the GFCI is much more sensitive and can save lives by shutting off the electrical flow when it detects a problem. Maintaining your pool and keeping it clean is important for sanitation and the life of your pool. Remember to check the filter cartridge every two weeks to see if it needs to be replaced. First, turn off or unplug the filter pump and either close the valves at the connectors or, if your pool does not have valves, plug the connector holes with wall plugs. To make it easy to remove the filter housing collar, Gently open the air release valve on top. Remove the filter top collar with a counterclockwise rotation, taking the top and the filter cover off, then lift the cartridge out. If your cartridge is dirty or brown in color, try spraying it clean with water. If it cannot be rinsed off easily, the filter should be replaced. Insert the appropriate Intex filter cartridge for your filter pump model. Replace the cartridge as shown and replace the filter top and housing collar. Close the air release valve. Reverse the instructions shown to put the pump back in operation. The air relief valve must also be opened briefly to allow trapped air to escape. Please make a selection from the menu to access other troubleshooting and maintenance tips.